one of the latest developments in the ongoing war. Israeli troops have claimed to have struck the house of top Hamas leader Ismail Haniyeh in Gaza. The Israeli Defense Forces or IDF shared a video of fighter jets bombing a house which they claim belongs to Ismail Haniyeh. Haniyeh is the head of Hamas's political bureau. He is reportedly among the highest ranking officials in the organization that governs Gaza. He is regarded as the head of Hamas by several countries. Israel claims Haniyeh's house was used as terrorist infrastructure and was being used as a meeting point by senior Hamas leaders to direct terror attacks against Israeli civilians and IDF soldiers. Haniyeh came into the limelight in the late 1990s and was the right-hand man to the Hamas founder Sheikh Ahmed Yassin in Gaza before the cleric was assassinated in 2004. Haniyeh was elected as the Palestine Prime Minister after leading Hamas to victory in 2006. He was chosen as the Hamas leader in 2017 and has largely controlled his group's political activities from outside Gaza. The IDF said that the Israeli troops today also located and destroyed a Hamas naval forces weapon cache containing diving gear, explosive devices and weapons. Israel has vowed to eradicate Hamas in retaliation for the attacks of October 7th, which killed 1,200 people, most of them being civilians. Hamas also took around 240 people hostage, among them elderly people and young children. But with the Hamas-run health ministry claiming the death toll from the offensive has now topped 11,500, including thousands of children, calls for a truce are mounting. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.